just love Concordia. I love everything about it. The position came open over here. It was a golden opportunity for a horticulturalist. I realized that this really was my calling. I was home here in a very short period of time. To be able to walk anywhere on campus and see someone you know, it makes you feel as if you're a part of a family in a lot of ways. Concordia became part of the Moorhead community more than 100 years ago. Concordia Language Villages is celebrating 50 years as a program of the college. From the beanie to the copper ring and the villager's name tag, Concordia embraces tradition while inspiring innovation. Whether you're in your first year or your third decade, Concordia is a place where you can feel at home while creating a transformative experience for students. It's a place where there's a real sense of we are all in this. It's not a place that we just work or a place that we're attending class or a place where we teach. This community, this place, Concordia, is a place that we are all in and part of. I've met the most incredible people working through Concordia College and Concordia Language Villages. And it's just, it's just amazing. I constantly say how much I love my job. It's, it's an amazing place. We're here to make a difference, and it isn't always the wins and the losses, you know, and sometimes that's what a lot of people look at, but uh, it's deeper than that for us. You know, I think the greatest joy I have is to see a young man grow in our program for four years and to walk across that stage and getting that diploma. That's what's important here, to go on in society and be productive. What we're doing in terms of helping people be better global citizens, that is worth putting one's life into. We could tighten screws or do carpentry work any place, but it's here that we really are helping prepare students and we play a real part in, in fulfilling that mission statement. Concordia's mission to influence the affairs of the world drives everything the college does. Concordia Language Villages uses one-of-a-kind language and cultural immersion programs to develop responsible global citizens. At the college, Concordia's faculty and staff challenge students to become responsibly engaged in the world. I work with people who think they're going to change the world at any moment. And I also think a lot of them will because they're that driven. Students come to Concordia with strong academic credentials, diverse talents, and a desire to become the change they want to see in the world. Every year we have 750 new minds on campus. They're going to go on all these little adventures and journeys and that I was part of the process and they're, I got to get to hand on the stick to someone else and say, here, now you get to lead them to another part of their journey. The nice thing about Concordia is it's given me the opportunity to grow personally, not just I'm here as a professor and this is what I do, but to explore kind of other options so that it's not a narrow role being defined for me. A teaching can happen in a room with a chalkboard, or maybe not even a chalkboard. What I find interesting and compelling is my colleagues and my students. Uh, they are different. They have come with new interests, new perspectives, new potential careers. You never know the impact of what you're doing, how it's affecting other people, but then when you step back and then you, you, that moment hits you and you go, wow, it's, it really give you a sense of the importance of what you're doing. That's where the liberal arts is. It's problem solving. There's a problem but it can't be solved. It can always be solved. I think the most important thing we can give our students is a sense of hope. Concordia's greatest asset is its people. A strong and supportive community united in serving the college's mission. It's so diverse. I mean we deal with uh, on the grounds we'll have generations of people, not only from this part of the country, but uh, all over the world. The other thing that um, drew me here was the size of the student body, because you have an opportunity to work with students over and over. You see them on the sidewalk, you have multiple appointments with them. I've worked at two large state universities as well. It's just a different feel being at a private little arts school. The students are full of energy, and they're fun and exciting. and one of the major reasons I enjoy working here. It just seems like this was the place I should be and this is what I was supposed to do.